Oh, what? Four artifacts? Enemies are going to outlevel me again. Why? Why did you do that? Oh. Okay. I guess it's back to leveling up. That said, we can upgrade our... Sh oh no, it's four artifacts collected in total. I'm an idiot. I'm an absolute idiot. So what should we do? We can get an additional front weapon here. Which is probably the best thing right now. Recharge rates. What are our recharge rates right now? Because I can't see it here what they were before. Like here I see the weapons and the agility and stuff. But I don't see recharge rates. I think they were boosted before as well. Not entirely sure though. Anyway, should we go into more weapons? I think right now we need more recharge rates. We need to recharge our weapons faster. Uh, not just our weapons, our everything. So going into engines should be the best course of action. And now we also have a higher energy class, so we can upgrade even more stuff if we can afford it. Which we can't. Oh, and I can also upgrade the plasma cannon. What should I take? Um, this won't work against cruisers and stuff. I think disabling weapon systems is probably the best. So let's go and try to get up here. That said, maybe I should have aimed for a time shock. Ah, that was probably stupid of me. Ah, well. Won't hurt us too badly. Okay, so it's not back to farming that much. But I will probably need to do a couple more missions. Simply to be able to afford everything that we can upgrade now. Here's the trade station. How can I be of assistance? I would like to land. Landing permission was granted. Thank you very much. Oh, look, it's another enemy with a bounty on his head. A uh, Glen Vath has been sighted in the Mezzacana system. This unscrupulous criminal must be brought to justice immediately. This is a challenge for experienced pilots. I think I qualify at this point. Let's try this. Hello, Glen Vath. Are you really alone? That would be very unfortunate for you already unfortunate that I'm coming after you. You are trying to mess with me? Fine. You're not going to survive that mistake. Oh wow, he is doing damage. He is just annihilating my shields. And he has support. Oh, I think that's actually turrets. So I should be fine if I just get out of their attack range. Because they can't follow me. Yes, it seems this way. Maybe it is drones as well. I'm not entirely sure. But let's just try to dodge as much of his fire as we can. Get behind him, start blasting. Okay, yeah, I think it's some sort of stationary or somewhat stationary weapon. Can you now stop? Oh, wow, I think he's throwing mines at me. Oh no, these are the drones. Okay, I'm going to ignore them, throw on plasma and blast him. Boom, baby. Alright, easy money. Alright, this is a forgotten container from Yankwala Cargo. A cargo vessel has accidentally left a container behind. We are looking for a pilot who will deliver this container to the cargo vessel as soon as possible. Let's take that mission and try doing it. After all, I got a better trade uh, cargo computer, so I should be able to carry at least a bit more. This is the trade station. The container has been placed behind the station. Retrieve it and take it to the cargo vessel. All right, sounds easy enough. Let's dock and uh, where is the cargo vessel? It's in that direction. I should already turn in that direction. Oh. What are you guys doing? Oh, is that the original cargo vessel? Strange. The cargo vessel has jumped already? Apparently they were in a hurry. I will transmit the data of your target system. Please make sure that your cargo arrives safely. 
Maybe that has happened before, but uh, this was not the correct portray for the person talking. Anyway, let's jump. There is the cargo vessel. Hello, anybody home? Hello? That's our container over there. Jettison it as we want to collect it. You don't sound that good, but let's do that for the moment. We have no reason... We have reason to be suspicious, but not reason to be hostile yet. And there it goes. Thank you very much. Your reward is already in your account. And that's 20,000 credits for basically nothing. Well, maybe some of these missions have different choices. But as I said before, we don't have a reason to be hostile yet. They haven't done anything breaking the law, so why should we attack? Alright, but I think that was the last uh, farm mission that I did for a while. We now have the ability to buy the improved cargo computer and double our cargo capacity. So that, or almost double it, it seems there's always 20 on top. So it would now go from 120 to 220. It's almost doubled. And that will almost double our trade profits as well. Which is really good. The next upgrade will only add another 100 tons and I don't see what would be the one after that. But this is a very good improvement. I still don't like the capacitor with 16% more. Uh, the next one, uh, the next capacitor here, it'll more than double our capacity. And the one after that is going to more than triple it. That seems a whole lot more worth than what we would be getting otherwise. So, now that all of this has been sorted out, I think I will do trade runs until I'm ready to enter the next system. Pirates have been sighted. Please follow the instructions of security personnel. Pirates have been sighted? Uh, okay, now I want to check that out. Maybe there's a bit of bounty in it for us. So is there pirates? There's bounty hunters, but I don't see any pirates. I now officially feel uh, played on, as in de deceived, misinformed. I'm not entirely sure what the correct English word is, but I kind of feel stupid now for trusting that. Okay, in this system there seems to be nothing really worth buying. Everything here other than drugs uh, is not valuable and I don't want to do a drug run. So I've decided to insta instead take this quest. It will take us to Tani, which we need to go through among other options to get to the system here where we can jump into the next cluster. Uh, so I will simply set Tani as target, accept this mission and then we will do another fight mission instead of a trade run. And there is Megina. I should time warp as much as I can. It's faster than boosting. I think I know who sent you. Do you have like is that I Yeah, there is basic you. pirates near you, so you actually do have support. That's it, your support is going down. Quickly. And now getting a thousand bounty per pirate. I think that's, what was it at the start, 470, 480-ish? Now it seems to be around a thousand. Oh, and I probably shouldn't be looking at my shields as much as I should be aiming. Uh, that said, I guess the latter are more important. Oh wow, he's going down. That was easy. Mission accomplished. 
Um, where even is the station now? I was turning around so much I had no idea. Thread the needle. Yes! Feels good to do that. If you manage to do it. So after all that trading and mission doing, I can actually buy an improved energy shield. I think I should do this. It seems to be quite a good boost. Like what we have right now, our energy shield. That's 28. And I guess it rounds up again. We are getting an additional 13. So a bit less than a third extra. Uh, which for a shield is actually quite good. Because we will need to shield ourselves from damage, otherwise we're just dead. This is 19 megajoule on top, so that's uh, almost half, actually. Yeah, it is good boosts you get. Anyway, next time I will be able to take the jump to Alpha Centauri. So this is, I guess, the actual cluster with Earth in it. We will have to acquire more keys to get to Sol in the end. But a uh, slight thought on my part, isn't Alpha Centauri uh, literally the closest star system to Earth? So shouldn't it be like, I think it's, the distance might actually be right. Looks like about four light years. I think that's how close it is in real life. But uh, what are the stars there then? There shouldn't be any stars closer to us than Alpha Centauri. Ah. Who cares? Anyway, see you guys next time, hopefully, when we will be continuing with the story. Until then, have a good day.